Today, we're having a little seafood boil at the office, celebrating our new seasoning. We're starting out with two gallons of the Orange Ocean. Now we're gonna add us some regular, oh, well, <laughs> Oh, if you do it like this, it comes out like that. Do it like this, and it comes out nice and smooth. Tips and tricks with Thanos. I think that should do because we got a lot of ingredients going in. And now you're going to need eight bottles of the new Dano seasoning. That's right. That's the blue top. We're going in with eight bottles. And remember, it's got a nice amount of paprika in there. Yes, Lord. One little eight ounce container of some minced garlic. Then we got 16 ounces of lemon juice. Give it a little stir. Oh, what's that you say? What's the other ingredients going in? Well, I got 12 ears of corn that I'm gonna cut in half, so it's gonna give us 32, because we're cooking for about 25 to 30 people. I got three and a half pounds of crab legs. Not everybody's gonna eat them. They can split them up and take one or two. I got five pounds of potatoes. It's three, four pounds of the reds, one pound of golds. I got three pounds of some little Brussels sprouts. I got three pounds of some whole white mushrooms. And then we got 10 pounds of raw shrimp. Don't buy the cooked shrimp, get the raw shrimp. I like to use the white shell on, deveined, easy peeling. All right, about 30 minutes later, we are now boiling. Let's get everything a good mix. Gonna go in with our potatoes, stand back. One white onion, cause we got it. We're gonna add our three pounds of flavor soakers. Put a lid on it, let that cook for about 10, 15 minutes. Been about 15 minutes, give it a little stir. Now we're going in with our Brussels sprouts and corn. Watch out, let that boil up for another 10, 15 minutes. So our last thing to add is the shrimp. It looks like we're gonna overflow in the bucket, not up here, but on the bucket. So we're gonna scoop a little bit of this juice out. Look at that, flavor, pack. Just feed the landscape. Look, you won't believe this. I literally just poured that juice out like 10 minutes ago. Look at this. Look, you got little crabs coming up out of the ground. All right, it's been another 10 minutes. I already tried the Brussels sprouts and the potatoes. They're done. The reason I made sure our Brussels sprouts and potatoes were done is because we're adding in frozen shrimp. This is going to kill the boil. Two more bags. And one more bag. I can tell you this, that is one full bucket of food right there. Let them come back to the boil. All right, it's been about 10 minutes. You can see those shrimps are done. It's getting ready to start boiling. We're gonna add these in right on top. Basically, all we're trying to do with these is just reheat them up. We're gonna put our lid on. We're gonna turn everything off. And now we just let them sit, soak up all that flavor for about 10, 15 minutes, then we eat. All right, they've soaked for 20 minutes. It's time <laughs> to take it inside. What do y'all think about that shrimp oil? Oh, that's great. 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 That's great.